Hello? Hello? Yes, Dr. Hamoudi, how are you? I'm doing good, how are you? I'm fine. What do you want to say to us, Dr. Hamoudi? First of all, let me welcome you here, and we are happy to have you. What do you want to say? Uh, I just wanted to uh, debate with you, if that's fine. Uh, I saw that you were up to debate, so I thought uh, I might give it a try. You know? I'm listening, my friend. Go ahead. What do you think about what we are saying, as long as you are listening? How well, shall we man? We were talking about uh, Prophet Solomon. Uh, no, yes, Prophet Solomon, right? Yeah, how he learned the language of the birds, but yet he speak the language of the ants. Well, first, uh, he knew how to speak to animals. That was one of his miracles. Hmm. And if I'm not wrong, do you also believe in Prophet Solomon? I don't know. Do you believe in him? Yes, I believe in him. But so, I ask but, you, but, do you believe in Prophet Solomon? Yeah, but I don't believe in the Prophet Solomon in the Quran. This guy is obviously is different, different guy. This is not the guy we knew. You just said that he he understand the language of the animals. But the Quran speaks okay. specifically saying he understand the language of the birds. He taught him only the language of the birds. Can you show me where in the Quran? Okay, can you show me my friend, Dr. Hamoudi? Can you show me where in the Quran it says that Allah, he taught him the language of the animals? Language of animals. No, it doesn't say that. Here we go. The verse in the front of me, chapter 27, verse number 16, it says, we taught him the language of the birds. Okay, so do you believe that he could speak to animals? Uh, for me, I don't believe in that, no. Okay, so what does your Bible say about Prophet Solomon? You tell me, I don't know. No, you're you're the Christian here. Well, I hear you. See, you are trying to change the topic. You see, what I, for me, I don't know anything about this. This is madness. This is crazy. I'm asking you. You are the one who says you can debate me, and now you are trying to say what your Bible says. The Bible doesn't say this is this madness. So what I will say to you, we, can, we cannot compare. So I'm asking you, how he learned the language of the birds yet, but he understand the language of the ants, and ants don't talk. You you claim to be a doctor, and if you are a doctor, you should know that ants are mute. Is that correct, or I'm making things up? First of all, I want to clarify, I'm not a doctor. So what are you? I am a citizen, I'm not I'm not a doctor. Is that a job to be a citizen? So what are you? Why you call yourself doctor if you are not a doctor? I'm a student, I'm a student. A uh, student, in what, what, what do you study, my friend? I'm studying uh, science uh, physics. That's wonderful, okay. So you can go right now in Google and you search, you will find that ants, they have their own language for sure, but it's not. Uh, speeches it is communication by vibration and by chemical so there's no way he can hear their speech the Quran says that he uh, Suleiman he heard her speech and his mind how he can hear it if it's not it's let us say uh, uh, the the and the she gave a warning by the chemical how you can hear that how that speech how that can be a speech? Uh, so you're absolutely right. Uh, ants, they don't speak as we humans speak, but they, they have a form of communication, right? And that's what we have in common with ants. True, true. All, right? all, uh, all, all, uh, you know, all the creatures, they communicate for sure. But this is not a question. It says here he was amused or amazed by her speech. So, you see... You, you know how to read the Quran, right? Read for me chapter chapter 27, verse number 19. It says, so he smiled, amused with her speech. So let us say the ant, she gave a signal by chemical, and this is their language, to the other ants. How he yes. was amused with her speech. Uh, wait, uh, what verse, please, in the Quran? Ch chapter, 27, uh, chapter 27, verse number 19. 27, chapter 19, okay. Hmm. I believe that it's in the Quran, but I just want to read and uh, see for myself. No so problem. That's fine. I, I encourage you always okay, so to, it says, to so, see. Okay, so it says, uh, uh, what uh, kind of version of Quran are you using? Well, whatever version you want. I like all versions. I don't like married women, actually. I like versions only. I have, I have Sahih International. Oh, okay, whatever you want. Read for us. Go ahead. So he, so it says, so Solomon smiled, amused at her speech and mm. said, my Lord, enable me to be grateful for your favor, which you have bestowed upon me 
and upon my parents, mm. and to do righteousness of which you approve, mm. and admit me by your mercy into the ranks of your righteous servants. Mm. Yeah. Right? And 20, and he took attendance of the birds and said, Why do I not see the hopo? Or is he among no, the no, but, uh, but but you did not read. Did you read for me chapter 19? Yes, I just did. Okay, can you say it again? Because I don't know. I don't know. You are reading something. Does, does it say, so he smiled, he was amused with her speech, the end? Yes, yes, yes. It says, in, okay. so yeah. uh, Solomon hmm. smiled, amused at her speech, and okay. said, my Lord, enable me to be grateful for your favor, hmm. which you have bestowed upon me. Okay. So the, here it says, my Lord, <laughs> means my God, enable me to be grateful for your favor. And? So God gave him a favor. He gave him uh, the miracle you know to talk with animals enable me to be great no 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 you, no you see my friend you have okay uh, uh, Hamoudi, listen if you go a little bit you will see that's allah he taught him the language of the birds so if allah taught him all the language of the animals then there's no need to say the birds he said specifically the word bird he did not say animals so he was he appreciate allah favor for he taught him but the quran this is this is a mistake here he taught him the speech of the birds read carefully verse number 16 we have been taught the speech of the birds. Solomon 16 says, and Solomon inherited David. He said, "O oh, people." Yeah, but this, this, is, his, his, this is uh, this is this is this is his dad. He, you know, he became all things. Indeed, this is evident bounty. Hmm. My friend, does it say he taught him the language of the birds? Does it say anything else? No, he taught yes, him the yes, language yes. of the birds. Okay, well, it says the language of the animals. And then it says, and we have been given from all things. All things is the is army, is a kingdom, is a flying carpet. You know, this is all things. But here he said he specifically. Talking about okay, uh, uh, Ham Hamoudi, Hamoudi, if there is one person in yeah. the world, he agree with you on your interpretation or you are making up stories. Because I can open for you any interpretation of your choice. And you will see that all of them agree that Allah, he taught him only the language of the birds. Okay, so do you want to take up tafsir on this verse? Anyone you want, any tafsir you want to read for us. Go ahead, what do you want? What tafsir you like to read? Okay, so I will bring up tafsir al-mizan, if that's okay. No problem, let me open al-mizan for you. This is, will be in Arabic, so we have to translate to, to people in English. No problem, okay. go ahead. I, I, I will watch your stream uh, in YouTube, okay? Uh, 2716, I will open al-mizan, hold on. Yeah, so you okay. cho you choose so, you choose some something like uh, an, uh, you 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 don't like the all the scholars you like the new scholars or you what what school you like? Uh, I am uh, Shia. Uh, if not, I, I I understand. This is why you chose the Mizan exactly. I know. Yeah. Yeah, and Namat, and it was verse uh, sixteen. Yes. Yeah, chapter twenty-seven, sixteen. Correct. Okay, let me open it, please. Now I'm going to Al Mizan. Yeah. And uh, give, I am give about me, to read. Give me a second, please. Let me or, open uh, Al Mizan yes. so we can put it in the front of us. There is a translation in English. Where? If, in which website? If you, if you type al mizan.org, it's a translation on English. It's quite good. It's, a, it's very good. Okay, go ahead. Read for us, and I'll, I will find uh, from my side here. Okay, so let me find the sword. 16. Mm. And Solomon inherited from David, and he said, My people. Okay, so this, this is the tafsir. All right. That is, that is Solomon inherited David's wealth and kingdom. According to some exegetes, mm. what is meant is that Solomon inherited David's prophethood and knowledge. Mm. The problem with this view is that prophethood cannot be inherited because mm. it is not transferable. Mm. Knowledge also cannot, can, cannot be inherited, mm. although it can be transferred in a sense. Even so. Hmm. Transfer of knowledge is only applicable in the case of acquired mental knowledge. The knowledge that is exclusively found among the prophets and messengers hmm. is of a different type. Their knowledge is not a result of mental activity, but it comes from God's grace and endowment. Hence, non-prophets can inherit knowledge from the prophets through their teachings, through, through their teaching and preaching. But a prophet does not inherit his knowledge from another prophet. No, what, a, you see, my friend, all of this has nothing to do with my question. So, where the, give me the, give me the answer. Where it says yeah, in the tafsir that he learned the language. Yeah, yes, okay. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. This is just talking about uh, the previous sentence. Okay, right, I'm coming. Right, no right, worries. Okay. Right, okay. 
And then it shows another verse of the Quran. And he said, O oh people and Nas, we have been taught the language mantiq of birds and we have been given all things. Most surely this is manifest grace. Okay, so here is talking about that special sentence, right? Okay. Mm. Here Solomon appears appears to be boasting to be boasting <coughs> about himself <coughs> and his father. But he is in fact speaking of God's bounties hmm. as per his command and as for the favor of your Lord do announce it. 9311 in okay. Quran. Okay. Some exegetes have insisted that the plural pronouns in we have been taught and we have been given refer to Solomon alone, not to him and his father. Hmm. Such use of plural is common in the language of kings and great figures. It is a way of including their servants and associates who help them in governing their kingdom. However, this view is not fully supported by the theme and thread of speech in the last verse. Now, uh, continue. Hmm. The meaning of Nas, people, humankind, here is clear. It refers to all people, not any particular group. My friend, my friend, are we, going, are we going to read the book? Can you tell me just the answer for that thing? Where in the whole of Seer it says that Allah, he taught him the language of the animals. I wanted to show him that. No need to read the yeah. whole book because this will be endless. I mean, we will read I everything. Just point out. Huh? I can't just point out. If you just read a sentence. No, 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 no it has to say that. No, no, it's no. Here we go. You see, I have it in the front of me. I cannot find anything. I have to do with what you are, what you are saying to me. So either you, you know, you say to us, this is what it is. And uh, here we go. I found it for you. Or, uh, you know, you say uh, I, it's not exist. Okay, so you claim. I'm not claiming. I want claim. an answer. I want an answer. Where it says that Allah, he taught okay. him the language of the, of, of the animals, my friend. I'm not claiming. I'm just asking you. Can you show me? In your, this is your tafsir. Where it says Allah, he taught him the language of the animals. I'm coming to that verse, brother. No, no. Go to the verse directly and give me the answer, please. I met the verse, but I must read. So I come to that sentence. Mm. I can't just... Okay, let me let me save your time. Like, Here we go. I find it in front of me. It says, read with me carefully. I'll read it in Arabic for you. What page? What, 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 what page 62? What page 62? What page 62? What page 62? Look at this. So he's saying it doesn't say he did not learn all the animals, but it doesn't it says he learned only the ants. So here in the in the tafsir saying there is nowhere it says that he did not learn all the animals. But the Quran said clearly uh, we taught him the language of the birds. So you wanted a tafsir of that special sentence, right? My friend, my friend, you see, uh, uh, you know, this is obviously a contradiction. Secondly, how sorry, how how, how the ant how how the ant how you, is the because simply he learned the language of the birds, but yet he understands the language of the ants. But ants don't talk. Where the, there's two mistakes first number the number one the, the healing they learn the language of the birds this is what the Quran is saying the Quran does not say we, we taught him the language of the animals it says the birds and the birds is kind of the animals secondly he said he he, he was amused with her speech but the ants don't talk they have language yes they communicate language yes by vibration or by chemical so okay okay so look listen listen to me okay mm -hmm. If I make the claim that the Prophet Solomon could mm. talk to animals, okay. but he could not talk to ants, would that make sense? Well, first of all, is is ants or animals? They are insects. Yeah, but are they are they are, they are they are they animals? No, they are insects. Okay, is is the birds animals or insects? So they are different kind. So even if you say he learned the yeah, language, you see, you you, you you just made a mistake now. Uh, you just admitted that animals are not insect. So if we say, for the sake of argument, let us say the Quran says we taught him the language of the animals, but the, the, the ants is not an animal. So he did not say that. He said bird specifically. Secondly, the, the ants are insect. They are not animals. Number three, he heard her speech, but the ants, they are mute. <laughs> All right. So All our, right. Uh, 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 listen, uh, Hamoudi, as long you are a Shia, you know, you know, yes. you uh, uh, like, you know, uh, 
uh, you as a Shia, okay. you, you have tons okay. of things. If we go to... Yes. You, you have tons of things which is totally far from the Muslim Sunni, correct? Uh, can you repeat? I didn't hear quite good. I'm saying that you Muslim Shia have totally different uh, understanding from the Muslim Sunni. Is that correct? In Quran, yes, and Ahadith. All yes. in the Quran, yeah, everything. You have a different understanding. Okay. And as long as you are a Not person, everything. what is the what is the most important book for the for the Shia? So what is the most? Can you give me a list of names of books? Quran. Huh? And Quran this is the most important book in Islam. But isn't it you Muslim Shia believe that the Quran, the real Quran, is with the uh, uh, the one who uh, this, you know disappear in the Surdab in the tunnel? I, I can explain this for you if, mm. if that's okay. So, do we have the Quran today? Do you have your Shia? Do you have the real Quran today, or you don't have it? Okay. Yes, we do have. Can I explain? Sure. Go ahead. Okay. So, we <laughs> Shia, we have the real Quran, the original Quran. We have it. It's there. Okay. Where? But what we believe where, where? is Tafsir. Where, where, tafsir no, of the Quran. No. Where? Where, is, see, where is the real Quran? Please, where, please, uh, brother, let me talk. Hamudi, Brother, Hamudi. Let me talk, where is please. where is the real Quran? I'm asking you. What is the name of the Quran? Real Quran? You have the Quran of Uthman. Is that the real Quran? Quran al Karim. It's the Quran which is okay. Uh, where we can find, my friend, where we can find this book, the 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 one I'm showing you in the screen. This is the book of Uthman. Is that the book? Is that, is that your book? Should I wa should I watch your stream? Maybe that would help. My friend, the verses we are reading until now. Thumma kuli means. I mean, it's the, like about about sorry about sorry man that he learned the language of the ants. This is the book of Uthman. So, do you Muslim Shia agree that the book of Uthman is the true Quran? Brother, okay. Can I explain? Go ahead. First that, then after the part where Imam Mahdi part, can I explain, please? Go ahead. Okay. So, there is <coughs> Fasha. You know what Fasha is? Fusha, not Fasha. Fusha. Yeah, Fusha. Hmm. Fusha. Oh, sorry, Fusha. Yeah. In Uthman version, it's only the Fusha. Oh, okay. Okay. So, and that is the minority of the books, if I'm not wrong. How is that? I mean, this is the, the this is the major book printed around the world. Where is the book? Yeah, then it's okay, yeah, yeah. But it's only the Fusha that's you know that uh, changed and such. It's not the words or such. So that is uh, uh, that. Okay. The second part of Imam Mahdi, mm. and you said that uh, it's not the real Quran. Let me explain that part, brother. Mm, okay. What we have is the real Quran. It's the Quran. It haven't. It hasn't been changed and such. Okay. Mm. But we believe Imam Ali alayhi salam. Mm. He came with a tafsir. Tafsir is something that explains the Quran. Okay. He came with this tafsir <laughs> and he brought it to the Sahaba. The All Sahaba right. de declined his tafsir and said, "We have made our own." So they have made their own tafsir with much mistakes. Now Imam Ali then didn't give his tafsir. It's not published. But we Shia believe when Imam Mahdi, mm. Allah Farajo, when he comes, he will bring the real tafsir, the, which explains the Quran in 100% true and correct. That's what we believe in the tafsir. It's not the it's he's hiding a secret Quran. That, that's not our belief. Well, you are mistaken. No, I'm not but mistaken. No, my friend, I'm not. I'm, I'm not mistaken. I'm very sure from what I'm saying. I study Islam very well. I have degree in Islamic law, and obviously you are the one who do not know. And you can watch in video right now in YouTube many scholars of the Shia saying that the true Quran is with Al Mahdi. Uh, 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 brother, no, not the Quran. Yeah, the real Quran is not here. The, the real Quran is the Quran of Fatima, and you don't have it. Is that correct? Oh, the Fatima, where did that come from? <laughs> oh, okay, well, where is this coming from? Okay, you know what? Uh, uh, as long you are a Shia and you accept the, the the books of the Shias and you accept what Ali he says, then let us see what Ali he says. Shall we go and see what Ali he says, if it makes sense, or Ali... Wait, wait, but don't, 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 don't jump into different things. Let us fulfill... Fully be clear here. Yeah, First, okay. also back to your claim, you have said that insects are not animals, correct? Well, are they? They, they are called. They, they are from different category. They are insect. In Wikipedia, it says insects or insecta from Latin insectarum are mm. hexapod, invertebrates, and the largest group within the arthropod phylum. That's I don't know. Insects are the most diverse group of animals. Mm. But. 
you see, you see, the, so uh, he, he, but here you have, have a, a group okay, but, 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 but here you have a problem. You are, you are the one who claim that the Quran says, or he, he been taught the language of the animals. No problem, but nobody says that. Secondly, if we assume that the insect are animals too, as you are getting from Wikipedia, is still that will be a problem because insect like ants are mute. So there is no way that Suleiman he can hear her speech. Because Suleiman is not God, he cannot uh, 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 like see the unseen. He cannot uh, uh, understand which nobody can understand. And the ants are not as long as they are not talking by voice, so he cannot hear it. He was reading her lips. Yeah. How how he understands how he problem. how he was. That's the miracle. Just as you believe, Jesus uh, took uh, he 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 took the dead people and made them live. He gave them mm. life. Just oh, as okay. you believe, that is a miracle. That's a miracle within Islam, brother. A mm. miracle cannot be bound to facts or logic. A miracle is a miracle. You can't really explain it. Can okay, you? can you give me? So that can, is, you, can you give me a, a, one miracles of Ali? I heard Ali he had miracles. Can you give me one of them? Imam Ali, mm. if he had miracles, yeah. I am sure that he uh, committed miracles, but what? I don't have any in my mind. But, but why? Why he had miracles? Is, why he had miracles? Is he a prophet? No. So why he had miracles? Okay. So let me explain. Mm. If it's that's fine. Mm. Sure. Go ahead. Okay. So there is a thing called karama. Mm. Now the prophets, the prophets, you know, they can do miracles. They can do miracles, you know, mm. by God. By God, they can do miracles mm. by God. Okay, what uh, Karama is, as you can see, as one of our scholars, Ayatollah Bahjet, he mm. was not a prophet, neither an imam, but he was a very religious guy, close to Allah. He used to pray to Allah a lot, and he was very close to Allah. Now, when you go close to Allah, you get certain things. All right, God makes you, gives you more Karama. Now, Imam Ali was very close to God. Both of us know that, right? Why is, <laughs> why, why, why is, why is that? Why is that? Why he was close to God? Why? He raped women. He killed He killed people. He he burned people alive. How he is close to God? No, no, no. The burned people alive is from the Sunni books, brother. Oh, okay. That's in the Sunni books. But did, did Ali kill a lot of people too? Did he? Uh, did he? War. Uh, in defending himself. Yes, he in, did. In, in war. But, but those people, they did not fight him. He is the one fighting them to steal their money. No, no, no. Right. What money? Let me he ask you. Very poor man. Uh, Haven't you read the hadith? Was, you said you know you what? know a lot about hadith, but sure, it doesn't sure. seem so. Let, if let you us. read the hadith, it mm. says clearly that Imam Ali was a poor man. And when Fatima Zahra wanted to marry Imam Ali, one of the people said, "Look, you have married your your daughter to a old to a poor man." Mm. If you read the hadith, yeah, but then, but, but, hadith, but then Ali, poor man. but but then uh, my friend, Ali. my friend, but 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 uh, you you Muslims, you you have a lot of fabricated stories. How Muhammad and his family, they are getting the fifth of every attack. This is in the beginning, they were poor because in the beginning he don't have an army. But then they are taking the biggest uh, share of the, of the army. They are stealing all the money. Even your prophet was accused of stealing underwear. Wait, brother, brother. Hmm. Did the Shia have the amount of army? No, 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 brother. Listen to me. Was Ali, oh, was Ali from the army of Muhammad or he was Listen. from the army of someone else? Brother, listen. Was Ali, was Ali from the army of Muhammad, yes or no? What did you say? Was Ali from the army of Muhammad, yes or no? Yes. Did Muhammad steal money from the people, yes or no? Not steal. So when you attack people, you take their show money. What does that mean? Says steals. Please show me where it says he stole money. Please show me. Okay, here we go. You see, I'm going to show you from the Quran because and then we can go to the interpretation and we can read together. Isn't it the Quran says... Uh, the the fifth from every attack is for what the prophet. Chapter, what chapter? What surah, brother? Okay, let us go to chapter nine, verse twenty-nine, to make it easier for you, fast and easy. Chapter nine, verse twenty-nine. Allah chapter prophet, nine. Allah prophet, he ordered his army, including Ali, to go and attack the Christians, steal their money, force them to pay jizya, so the Muslims can live a fancy life and they don't go to war. In okay, chapter wait, chapter nine. Chapter 9, verse number 28 to 29. Read it for us. Okay, 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 yes. Hmm. 
Okay, I will read. Okay, hmm. all you have, all you who have believed, indeed the polytheists are unclean. Hmm. So let them not approach al Masjid al Haram after this their final year. Right. And if you fear provision, hmm. Allah will enrich you from His bounty if He wills. Indeed, hmm. Allah is knowing and wise. Right. Okay, so here is telling the Muslims, hmm. do not let them polytheists who are unclean hmm. to approach Masjid al Haram, which is indeed a very holy site for us Muslims. Hmm. Correct. Okay. Yeah. So, I, but then, you, but you are. Uh, you, if, but no, no. Before, before, before you jump to the second verse, it says there, if you are afraid from a property, Allah will reach you. Correct. And if you fear provision, Allah will enrich you from His bounty if okay. He wills. Okay. If how he, wills. how he will reach them? Read the verse after it, and then we will know how Allah will reach them. Go ahead. All right. Fight those who do not believe in Allah. Or in the last day, mm. and who do not consider unlawful what Allah and His Messenger have made unlawful, and those who do not adopt the religion of truth mm. from those who were given the scripture. Mm. The scripture means to injil, mm. fight, and mm. you know who have given the scripture, fight mm. until they give the mm. jizya willingly mm. while they are humbled. Mm. So, this is a theft. So I am sitting in my home. I don't believe in your belief. You launch a war on me. And the excuse is, I don't believe in your book. And now I have to pay you money, so I will live. And you are saying to me, this okay. is not a theft? Okay, let me ask you, you are an Iraqi, correct? Yes, correct. Okay, the American, they, they came to Iraq. Did they force you to pay yes. Jizya? What did you say? Did they force you to pay Jizya to protect you? No. Okay. So you're a prophet. They, Imagine they this. Don't Iraq. Okay, hold on, hold on. No, 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 no. They, no, no. They protect Iraqi. If not, if not them, the ISIS will be eating you alive. It was the American who saved you. All of everybody who knows. ISIS. Yes. Please, please, who created us? No, no, no. Don't, 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 don't go with this garbage. You, you, you're a prophet. He created ISIS. Now, no, that's not to go no, on the topic. No. Hold on, hold on, hold on. So, how in the world you come to my land? You take my land. You take my property, and then you force me to pay you money to protect me from you. And this is not a theft. Okay. Let me... Can I talk first? Go, go ahead. <laughs> okay. Now, in, in the time of the Prophet uh, mm -hmm. and when they lived, of course, not everyone were holy and very good. Of course, there were bad people, Muslims, as there are bad people everywhere. Mm. It's natural. People are bad. Mm. And they were bad Muslims in that day. Ah. Now, the, the Christians, despite <laughs> what we don't... My friend, my friend, my friend, don't, 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 don't waste my time. There's bad Muslim, there's bad Christian. Is, is your prophet and Ali bad or not? The one who practiced this is your prophet and Ali. What is the reason in the world to attack somebody? He is a Christian who believe in God. I am okay, why, you, why you want to kill him? And why, if he pay you money, you will not kill him? Give me the reason. I want to know. Okay, I am explaining, but stop okay. cutting it. But why you are saying there's bad Muslim, there's bad... What does have to do? It says fight all coming the Christians. The fight, all, the fight all the Christians. Fight all the Jews. Kill them all or they pay. Pay or die. This is what the verse is saying. And I have your own okay, Islamic Shia okay. interpretation in front of me. Okay, okay, pay, okay, pay okay, or die. The nonsense, sir. Mm, okay, go ahead. If you want, we can put the nonsense. We can continue mm. on the same. If you go to... Uh, El -ta -el -tawba, then we go to verse 30 after the verse we just read okay, mm. okay. the Jews say Ezra is the son of Allah mm. and the Christians say the Messiah is the son of Allah mm. that is their statements from their mouth mm. they imit imitate the saying of those who disbelieved before them mm. may Allah destroy them how are they deluded they have <laughs> taken their scholars and monks as lords beside Allah mm. and also the Messiah the mm. son of Mary, mm. and they were not commanded except to worship one God. Mm. There is no deity except him. Mm. Exalted is he above whether they associate with him. They want to extinguish the light of Allah with their mouth, mm. but Allah refuses except to perfect his light, mm. although the disbelievers disliked it. And? It is he who has sent his are you, messenger. Are you going to read the whole chapter? Give me the answer. Okay, and what, what we get from this? The Christian, they don't believe in Islam. They are they are debating Muhammad. They are saying you are a fraud. And you are saying to me, because they don't believe in Islam. They don't believe in the God of Islam. This is the reason for you to attack them and tell them, if you pay, you will live. 
You see, here you see the, here you see the hypocrisy of your prophet and Ali, because he did not say, "I will kill you if you don't believe." He accept a bribe of money. If we pay him, still we can worship false god. Why he accept? Because he is a fraud. You see, if I am a person fighting for the sake of God, not for the sake of money, I will not accept your money to stop killing you because. First of all, I'm fighting you because you worship the wrong God. So how in the world, if I pay you, then you will not kill me and I can still worship Jesus if Jesus is a false God. So all what Muhammad want and Ali want is the money. Give me the money, you live. And it's in the front of you, it says, if you are afraid from property, because simply they stop the people from coming to the Kaaba and now business is bad. So Muhammad, he found a solution. Let us attack the Jews, attack the Christian, steal their money, and we force them to pay us, die or pay or, or, or die. That will make your Ali a thief and Muhammad is a biggest a, a, a gang member. Gang member? <laughs> yes. Okay. So are you saying to me, it's okay for me now? I will take your logic. If I go to Iraq right now and I say, okay, all Shia, I will give you three days. Either you convert to Christianity or you have to pay me jizya or you die. Are you saying this is okay? Listen. No, no, don't tell me listen. Are you saying this is okay? If I say to you, if I say to you, you Shia in Iraq, either you pay me or I'm going to nuke you tomorrow. So is that okay? I will answer. Okay, I will answer. Go ahead. Today, we don't need that anymore. Why? Because the society has developed. Now, if you look into Iran, no, not you no, 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 no. You see, you are you are you are running away. You are running. You are running away from the question. What today? Now, what today? Not we do not need. No, today you are forcing the Christian to convert to Islam in in Baghdad in Iraq. You send them letters. You put it under 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 the door. Tomorrow, if you don't convert to Islam, you have to die or you have to pay. Go read the news. This is right now, 2020. And this is why there's almost no Christian left in Iraq. What are you talking about? I'm asking you, don't change the topic. Why in the world, okay, if so I pay you money, if I, if I pay you money, if you are not a thief, why you want money from me so I can stay worshiping my false God as you say is false? What kind of a prophet he accept you? We worship the same God. No, we don't. You worship the moon god. We don't worship the moon god. You kiss a black stone. We don't kiss a black stone. You worship Ali. You think Ali is a light from Allah. Do you do you believe Ali is a... Okay, hold on. Is Ali was a light from the light of Allah? Yes or no? What? Is Ali made from the light of Allah? From the light? Yes. What do you mean? Okay. You see, you are the one who said to me, you believe in Tafsir al-Mizan, right? Yes. Okay. So now if we go to this verse, and I ask you, read for me the tafsir, whatever tafsir you like. Here it says in the Quran, okay. and this is your Shia tafsir, not the Sunni, forget about the Sunni, right? Chapter 33, verse number 46, it says, And we made him, uh, We made Muhammad as a lamp. Okay, if we go to the Shia tafsir, Wait, can you show me where? Can you show me where? Chapter 33, verse number 46. 46. Okay, I'm going to that. Yeah. Okay. Can I read it for you? Go ahead. And give me the interpretation, please. 46. And one who invites to Allah by his permission and an illuminating lamp. Hmm. Yeah, that's the verse. Okay. What is the seal of the Shia for this? And then about the word eliminating lamp. Yeah, this is Muhammad. Muhammad is a lamp. Okay. What you Shia, what you Shia believe about this? Okay. First, it says, "O Prophet, indeed we have, we have to read between to understand." My this. friend, can my friend, oh, my friend, can you can you read for me the interpretation of the Shia? Okay, okay, I will do that. Mm. No problem. All right. If the interpretation is there, okay, I will go to Al Mizan now. Hmm. El Mizan and it's Surah Al Ahzab, correct? Correct. Okay. Surah, is it here? Surah Al Ahzab is not here, but we can go to another. 
الأحزاب تفسير okay. It was verse 45 In your tafsir this uh, Mizan doesn't say anything about this verse It just jump over it No, so, it's not written in the Mizan Yeah, so we have to find, you know uh, uh, Different tafsir of your choice Because there is no tafsir there Yeah, that's the problem. I'm trying to find one. Mm, 46, right? Mm -hmm. If not, I I give you tafsir based on... Okay, no, it doesn't come. Okay. Okay, my friend, let me let me show you. I will put something in okay, the screen. Let's read. Okay, let's read. Al-Alam al-Majlisi fil-Bihar. Do you know him? Al Alam al Majlisi. Al Alam al Majlisi. Uh -huh. Okay. Okay. Yes. okay. Uh, you will see it's speaking there. The whole article is about is speaking about that uh, Fatima is created from light. So they are speaking in the whole article that uh, that uh, 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 let me read for you the hadith from 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 uh, from you Shia. Uh, give me a second, please. It says. <coughs> Um, remember, I'm not going to use a, a Sunni. Just you know, so you don't say. Okay, here we go. Yes. This is Bihar al Anwar. I'm sure you know the the book very well. You cannot say this is fabricated book. All right. No, no. no. We have to understand the history of that book. My you friend, don't tell me history. This book. is the this is this this is his. Uh, no problem. This is history, guys. But. Is that history? Is your history or my history? This is your books. This is what you believe. Those are your scholars. No, no, no. Okay. That, that's not what I meant. Okay. Do you understand? The let me of let the me book let me read book. let me read for you, my friend. And this is Biharul Anwar, variant number thirty-seven, page number eighty-three. It says here, and I will go. Uh, uh, it says here. Let us see. Inna Allah khalaqni wa khalaq aliyan wa Fatima wa Hasan wa Hussein. قبل أن يخلق آدم عليه السلام. Let me translate. Allah He created uh, uh, me and created Ali and Fatima al Hassan al Hussein before He created Adam. And there was no sky built, and there is no earth, flat earth, and there is no darkness, and there is no light, and there is no sun, and there is no moon, and there is no heaven, and there is no hell. And then Al Abbas He said, and how? Uh, uh, how the, the start of your of your uh, creation or prophet of Allah, Messenger of Allah? He said, "لما أراد الله أن يخلقنا تكلم بكلمة خلق منها نور ثم تكلم بكلمة أخرى فخلق فخلق منها روحا ثم مزج النور بالروح فخلقني وخلق عليا وفاطمة والحسن والحسين عليه السلام." Let me, let me translate. When Allah He decided to, to, to create. He created by a word, he created the word, and from the word he created the light. And in one other word, he created a, a spirit. My friend, this is Sahih. This is this is Biharul Anwar. There's no game here. And he no, created no, no. and he That's created hadith let, hadith me finish, let me finish, let me finish, let me finish. Let me finish, let me finish. And he created a spirit. So he created Nur and he created spirit. And then he mixed the Nur, which means the light, with the spirit, and this is how he created me and created Ali and created Fatima. So when I say to you that according, and read carefully here, it says, uh, 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 he continues saying, فَلَمَّا أَرَادَ اللَّهُ تَعَالَىٰ أَنْ يُنْشِئَ الصَّنَعَىٰ فَتَقَ نُورِي فَخُلِقَ مِنْهُ الْأَرْشِ When Allah he decided to create his, his, his miracles, he, he, uh, uh, he uh, like he uh, uh, opened my light and he created his throne from, the throne of Allah created from the light of Muhammad. And he's and he continues saying, "Fal arsh min nuri, wa nuri min nur Allah, wa nuri afdalu min al arsh." So the throne of Allah is from my light, and my light is, is from the, from from the light of Allah. Muhammad's talking, and my light is from the light of Allah, and my light is better uh, better than the light of the throne of Allah. And then he continues saying, uh, uh, "I mean, uh, uh, this is this is this is ma this is madness. This is ma uh, this is what you Muslim believe." Muhammad, and he continues even speaking about, about sahih, Fatima. Sahih. Look at that Fatima. So Sahih, this is Biharul Anwar. 
Okay, I told you that, therefore, I told you before this. Do mm -hmm. you know the history of Bihar al Anwar? My Do friend, you know my friend, my friend. Okay. Just, Sh shall I give it to honestly, you? Okay, you see? Answer me. Okay, okay. Ho answer me. So, so now are you saying that this is a fraud book? No, no, no. Okay. Just answer me honestly. So either, either you, you know say, either, okay, means? either you say, okay, either you say this is a lie and this book is lying and the author is lying or you say this is true. You options. No, you That's have to give ridiculous. me. So what do you want to say to me? Do you know the, the, the history? What, why I need to? Here's, I'm here's, asking you, is I'm this saying. a story? Is it true here. or not? Is this a story, my friend? Is this a story true or not? You're, you're not telling me if it's Sahih or Hassan or Zaif or anything. It's not. It's, it's not it's, uh, 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 in front of you. I'm showing you from your book. Why is going to be? Uh, nowhere it says that this is Zaif. Can you show me why it says this is Zaif? Show me. Okay, uh, I will look live stream now i will look into your live stream now yeah okay let me put it and for show. you let me put it for you in the live screen uh, here we go let me put it for you again in the screen so you can see it no problem wait wait what is your channel's name you do not know my channel arabian prophet uh, arabia yes right that's mm. right arabian mm. prophet live stream right yeah okay so I'm watching. Yeah, I'm sorry if it echoes. No problem. Okay, Don't I'm worry. watching. Hmm. Do you see the hadith in front of you? And this is Bihar and Anwar, yeah. volume 37, page number 83. Okay. Continue. So what, what is the answer? As you see, you Muslim Shia believe that Ali and Muhammad are created from light. They are not a human like us. <laughs> Let me read for you. Your Arabic is not good like for me. How, how you are in Iraqi but your Arabic is very horrible. <laughs> لما أراد الله أن يخلقنا تكلم بكلمة بكلمة خلق منها نورا ثم تكلم بكلمة أخرى فخلق منها روحا ثم مزج النور بالروح فخلقني وخلق عليا وفاطمة والحسن والحسين عليهم السلام فكنا نسبح ها؟ it's talking about the ruh, not the physical brother. No, it's a read carefully. It says he created light and then and then my friend, what's wrong with you? Do you have eyes? It says he created light and then he created a spirit and then he mixed the spirit with the light. So the body of Muhammad yeah. is light. No, spirit. No, spirit. it says no. No, read carefully. It says here, Thumma mazajan. Do you know do you know what mazaja mean? Thumma mazajan nura Do you do you see it? Yes, I see it. Okay. What does that mean? Translate. I'm listening. Hmm? What? That's the physical no no this is this is this is, this is his creation before he created adam my friend there was no earth yet listen listen uh, listen 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 please please don't waste my time don't waste my time there's no earth yet there's no heaven yet there is no there's no stars yet read carefully there's nothing was created yet so he created the world and from the world he created light and from the light he created uh, 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 other, other word he created a uh, spirit and then he mixed them together there was no dust there was no sand there was nothing and then then he says thumma, thumma akhi, uh, uh, Ali. so and then he opened the light of my brother Ali and then from his light the angels are created min nuru akhi, Ali, wa nuru Ali min nuru Allah. so Brother. No, Very no, specific. no, my friend. What, what, uh, what? Uh, th this is how he created Ali. Ali created from light, and the angels are created from the light of Ali. Are you blind? It says the ruh, brother. My friend, read carefully. Did it say that he? Did, you, read did, you read carefully. Okay, okay. Does it say? Does it say? Let us go to zero. Let us go to zero. Does it say that he mix? He mixed the light with the ruh with the spirit yes or no yes okay the light now the okay spirit. so spirit. now okay are you, say, are you hearing yourself okay. you're saying spirit you're Sp not saying physical body you're no saying no problem no problem so muhammad now is exist ali is exist but he is a spirit and light correct 
Yes, spirit. Thank you. So yes. Muhammad existence is this is how he was created. He is created from light, his light, and his spirit is mixed with the light. So Muhammad and his family are created from light and they have a spirit in it. And as you see, even even your book saying that Allah created his throne from the light of Muhammad. Allah created the angels from the light of Ali. Am I lying or this what it says in front of you? Yes, you're, you're, you're reading what it says. Okay, yes. and then read carefully me. And then he says, ثُمَّ فَتَقَ نُورَ إِبْنَةِ فَاطِمَة And then he opened the light of my daughter Fatima. And from her light, he created the sky and the earth. Does it say that? Yes. Okay. How in the world from Fatima, the whole earth and the heaven created from Fatima light? And you are saying to me that we Shia, we don't worship Ali and, and, and Muhammad. You don't believe in them. They are a human like us. They are light. They are the light of Allah. They are from the light of Allah. And Allah is light. So Allah is light. Listen carefully. Allah, Allah is light. That is your opinion. That is your tafsir. My friend, it's not my tafsir. It's in front of you. How in the world does it say that Ali is light? Yes. Does it say that Muhammad is light? Yes. Does it say that Fatima is light? Yes. And does it say that the oh. angels are created from the light of Ali? Yes. Oh. Does it say that the throne of Allah created from the light of Muhammad? Yes. Does it say that Fatima from her light, the earth and the heaven are created? So all of us, we are created from the lights of Muhammad family. This is what it says, correct? No, it doesn't say that. That's your interpretation. What do you mean my interpretation? Okay, let us go to zero. It says that Allah created, uh, you agreed with me, that Muhammad and his family, they are mixed of a soul or a spirit no, and light. Don't. I agree that okay. their spirit is of light. Spirit and light, spirit and light. They are mixed together. So they are together. They are like his 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 physical body is a, is a, is, is a light. Is, is, wait, is a, let me ask you. Let me is ask a light. You. No, don't is ask me. Is the spirit a human body? No, it's not. No, nope, exactly. He is made not from a human body. He is made from light. Yes. Until now, there's no human body. He he, he is made. The hadith is probably da'if if you're telling me this. My friend, there's no da'if. You want to make it da'if now? Suddenly it became da'if. Anything you Muslim you don't like, you make no, it da'if. Okay. What's the source? I will I will look onto this hadith. Here we go. Let me show it to you in the screen so you don't say, um, you know, here we go. Bihar al-Anwar, al-Allam al-Majlisi, volume number 37, page number 83. Wait, in my screen it's not, it's showing old footage. No problem, it's going to be there. Okay. Okay, but at the meantime, uh, can we talk, you're you're a Christian or are you atheist? Well, no, 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 I became a believer in Ali, that's it. Ali is light and Fatima is light and I have no light in my room. I mean, why I need light? The whole world they created from Fatima and Ali and Muhammad. I mean, what is that? Uh, uh, okay, it doesn't say anywhere that the hadith is sahih or correct. My Let friend, you, my friend, Anwar, my friend, the what, what? Of Bihar and Anwar, listen to me. Listen I can show it to you from different book, no problem. I can show it to you. I can show it to you from different book. I can show it to you from different book. I respect you when you talk to me. Can you respect me, please? But I can show it to you from different book. What the problem? Suddenly now, Bihar and Anwar is not a trustworthy book for the Shia. No, I'm not saying that, but okay. listen to me. So, Bihar al and when Men in Majlis he composed Bihar al Anwar, mm -hmm. he didn't care what hadith he put in the book. Mm -hmm. He wanted to take all the hadith possible. As you can see, it has 100 volumes, correct? Mm -hmm. It has 100 volumes. That amount of books is impossible to make. It, ha it has to take a lifetime to mm -hmm. create such much amount of volumes. Mm -hmm. Therefore, al Majlisi, when he put a hadith on his book, he didn't care if it was Sahih. Or Vaif. He mm. just wanted it on his book. So later on, researchers can research. So what he put in his book was not Sahih or, uh, or Vaif. He does. He didn't know. He just put anything people told him. So later on, researchers can research into his books and say this was Sahih, this was Vaif. Okay. So when you're giving me references from Bihar and Anwar, it's always 50-50. Mm. Which 50 you like? Hello? Hello? Are you there? <laughs> I 
See, any 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 book is embarrassing. Suddenly they start making. I mean, it's obvious that those people they worship them. Are you there? Sorry, my. Okay, let, I, let me ask you. To... Let, let me ask you. What is the word Horia mean? What? What is the word Horia mean? Horia. Hmm. Uh, I don't know. You tell me. Mermaid. Okay. Okay. Is is Fatima a mermaid or she is a human? She is a woman, a human being. Okay. So why why your prophet saying that she is a mermaid? Where does it say so? I can't find you. Here we go. Same stories. Let us see. But you you're coming with such ridiculous thing. Of course. There will be fabrications in the hadith, but there is fabrications in your Bible, brother. My friend, my friend, if my Bible have fabrication, that means Allah again is a false god because the Bible is sent by Allah. And if Allah cannot protect no, his no, book, no. that's mean you got no the Bible is sent by the Holy Ghost that came into people. Are you ludicrous? The Bible and the Christians say that the Holy Ghost came into people and they wrote okay but, but, but the, okay sure. hold on but for us the holy ghost, the is, ghost but for like us the holy ghost the holy ghost for us is god i'm asking you now isn't it the quran says that allah is the one who said is a creation by god it no 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 you know this is there is no okay how you where, where do you learn first time about the holy ghost where you heard this word from and why it's called holy and ghost if it is not god can you tell me you know what the Holy Ghost is for us Muslims? I'm asking it's you. No. Okay, I have a challenge for you. If you can me one, find me one verse in the Quran that says that the Holy Ghost is Jibreel, I will shave my 20 foot beard. Where, I didn't hear. where do you get this? That where do you get that Jibreel is the Holy Ghost? <laughs> See, he's trying to change the topic, but no problem. Do you hear me? Yeah, I hear you now. Okay, sorry. Okay. I want you to show me where you can find the proof that Jibreel, an angel, is the Holy Ghost. No, 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 no. The angel Jibreel, mm. for us, he's, he's not a ghost. So why, so, so what is the Holy Ghost in the Quran? I don't know if we have a ghost that goes on to people and makes them write. Uh, that's probably my a friend here we I go okay okay here we go things. okay here we go in front of you chapter 2 verse number 87 it says and then we sent uh, we gave Moses the book and after that we sent the Isa and we supported him by the Holy Ghost who is the Holy Ghost and how he supported the Isa you said it's funny to believe that the Holy Ghost come and make people write books correct okay so Isa now he is receiving the support of the Holy Ghost. What is the Holy Ghost? The, it says the Holy Spirit. My friend in Arabic, Wait, this is the same Holy Ghost. The Ruh al Qudus. Ruh al Qudus. Holy, Holy Ghost is a translation. Ghost translation for the word Ruh. So you can Holy Spirit, you can say Holy Spirit, you can say Holy Ghost. It's the same. Ruh. So I'm asking you. What is the Holy Spirit? How it is holy and what is that spirit? A spirit is not a. You know what a ghost is? You tell me. No, what is it? Do you want to look up the definition of the ghost? It's a spirit. The same. They call it no, ghost. No. They call it ghost because it's invisible. Because it is invisible. Spirit there is, is in a definition of the ghost. My friend, this is this is person. anyway, 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 anyway. This is this is an English translation, my friend. Don't 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 fool yourself. This is English translation. Now we are talking about in the Hebrew and in the Arabic. Both of them they say Holy Spirit. So I'm asking you. The Quran said exactly the same word as in the Bible, Holy Spirit. I'm asking you. How this spirit is holy, and what is that spirit, and what she did to Isa? If she is a female or male, I don't know. Okay, can you show me the surah and the chapter and the two, verse? chapter two, verse number eighty-seven? Surah Al-Baqarah, mm. eighty-six. The, the cow, cha the cow chapter. Do you know what they call it? The cow chapter. Uh, 
Al Baqarah. I actually don't know. And like yeah, be because your prophet uh, Musa, uh, Allah told him there's a guy he is dead. Somebody killed him. He told him beat him with some beef, and he will come back to life. And now they are using the beef beating to bring people to life because of Corona. Corona. No. <laughs> yeah. Okay, let's read the 80, verse 87. Mm -hmm. And we did certainty give Moses the Torah and mm. followed up after him with messengers. Mm. And we gave Jesus, the son of Mary, clear proofs mm. and supported him with a pure spirit. But it, But is it not that every time a messenger came to you, all children of Israel, with what your souls did not desire, you were mm. arrogant and a party of messengers you denied and another party you killed. Mm. So here it says, pure spirit in Sahih International. Okay, who is, who is a pure, save God? What? If there is anyone in this universe pure beside God, holy, pure mean holy. If there is someone, uh, uh, you see, in Arabic it says Qudus, you know, you speak Arabic. So the translation you have is a potato translation. No, it, it doesn't say even speak, it doesn't even yes. say pure. It says Qudus. Qudus mean holy, correct? Yes, yes, it right. does. Actually. Okay, so it is a holy spirit. Okay, if there is someone according to Islam is holy beside Allah. Yeah, the prophet messenger is holy. Thank you very much. So now we go back to zero. Your prophet must be God because he is holy. Because I thought no, only he, Allah, he's holy, he's holy. I thought he's only, God. so you are saying to me, not only Allah is holy, Muhammad is holy too. So now we have two holy. We have the holy Allah, we have the holy Fatima, we have the holy Ali. Okay, hmm? okay. 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 Let me, let's go to the definition of holy. A definition of holy one, hmm. dedicated or consecrated to God okay. for a religious purpose. Hmm. Dedicated or consecrated to God, it means someone who is close to God. Not God. Ah, okay. See, that's your fault. Okay, hold on. So I'm, I'm going to ask you again then. The Holy Spirit is supporting Isa. What the Holy Spirit is doing, how it supports Isa? Uh, how, would, how it supports uh, Nabi Isa? Hmm. Uh, if you read, it strengthened him with the Holy Spirit. It says it strengthened him. Okay, how he strengthened him? How, okay, how you strengthen a person with Holy? It's a spirit. It's a spirit. How you can strong a person with a spirit? It's not even visible. Does this spirit okay. have? Does this? You, does this spirit? Uh, uh, hold on, hold on. Does this spirit hold power? Uh, no, but it can uh, give you motivation. But you are the one who made fun of us, a Christian. You said that your Christian believe that Holy Ghost come to you and made you write books. Now you are saying that the Holy Ghost give you motivation to do things and write things. So yeah. you just contradict, is, contradict yourself. No, hold on. If, so, 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 the, 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 okay. Allah, hold on. Allah, he gave Isa the Injil. Who is the one who gave Isa the Injil? Allah or the Holy Spirit? Uh, see, Allah gave him the Injil, but not directly. Mm. Allah didn't uh, give him with his hand. Okay, what he did? Allah, so, so, God. so how he did? So how he did? Uh, he he gave the Injil. Well, the Injil is written also by his disciples. This is another question. This is another question. How Allah gave Isa the Injil? Uh, I guess through I guess hmm. through uh, angel, angel Jibrail. And is that the Holy Spirit? Yes. If so, you can so why you were way. why you were laughing, saying you Christian believe that Holy Ghost inspire you and make you write books, but you just said the same. You just said that Jibril okay. is the Holy Spirit. Ghost, hold on, Holy hold Spirit, on, hold on, thing. hold on. Yes, it's the same thing. You just you just admitted no, that you hold on. You are the one who just said that the one who gave Isa is the Injil is the Holy Spirit, not Allah, and He is the one who made him write things. So you must then believe in the same thing, but you make fun of us now. So, so, same time. How Allah, He is given a title for an Believe angel. Hold on, hold on. When, you, when we say, when we say someone, when you say someone, when you, when you say someone is holy, did he commit sin? No, no, prophets don't commit sins. I'm talking about the Holy Spirit. When we give it the title, the title is a Spirit and Holy. When we say Holy Spirit, did the Holy Spirit ever in Islam commit sin? No. So why Allah accused the Holy Spirit and the rest of the angels? Because you said the angels, the Holy Spirit is an angel Jibreel, right? 
How Allah He accused all the no, angels said, to be. I said it can be manifested. No, you said it's an angel, right? Is no, it, is, is the Holy Spirit, is the Holy Spirit an angel, Jibril? Yes or no? It can be manifested in that way. This yes. is not the question. Is the Holy no, Spirit, a... according to Islam, according to Islam, is Jibril is the Holy Spirit? A Holy Spirit. Hmm. What is your definition of the Holy Spirit? I'm asking Spirit? you, you know, are you in Islam, not my definition. I am asking you in Islam, is the Holy Spirit the angel Jibreel? I cannot answer fully because I don't have that. What do you mean? But two, I'm saying two, two he minute, two, in but two minutes ago you said he's Jibreel. So what happened now? Suddenly you don't want to, you cannot say. You said that already. I said it can be manifested. The viewers. What do you, what, viewers, what, what, what do you mean? What manifested? What what manifested me? What manifested me? Explain to me. I'm not understanding. Manifested can be me. For example, mm. if you see some, if you if you when prophets see a sign of God, mm. they manifest it into being the sign of God. Otherwise, they can manifest it into something else. Okay. So, so now the question is: this still we are here. According to your interpretation as a Shia. Is the Holy Spirit an angel and his name is Jibreel? Yes or no? Okay, I am. Is it okay if I search it up? Because I told you I don't have that. Knowledge. No problem. I, can say, I only said it can be manifested. No problem. Search it. Uh, I think it is. It can be manifested, but this, not this, always. This is not a question. I want to know if this is Jibreel or not. As simple as that. Stop saying using the word manifested. You manifest me with manifestation manifestation i want you to tell me is is the holy spirit is jibreel as simple as that yes okay thank you very much guys he agree that the holy spirit is jibreel but the quran says that the angels they committed a big sin and this is why allah he ordered them to bow down to adam if we go to chapter 2 chapter 2 and then we read yes. verse number 30. Allah, he said to the angels, and remember, the Holy Spirit is one of the angels. Allah speaking to all the angels, no exception. Uh, Allah, he said uh, to the angels, I will create someone to inherit the earth. They said, will thou place their end, one who will make uh, mischief their end and shed blood? You know, will you celebrate and, uh, and we are the one who celebrate you and praises you and glorify your name? He said, I know what you know not. And then Allah, he taught Adam all the names of all things. Then he placed them in before the angels. And he said, tell me the names of those things. If you are truthful, not right. You see translation here, it says, right. This is a lie. In Arabic, it says, in kuntum sadiqeen. Do you agree with me that the word sadiqeen means truthful? Sadiqeen, yes. Exactly. So Allah that accusing... That is your translation. No, 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 no. I, this is your translation. I'm asking you, is the word Sadiqeen mean truthful? Yes. Okay, so don't tell me this is my translation. This is your translation now. So no, no, if you are you have on if you are truthful, so Allah accusing the angels to be a bunch of liars because he's saying to them, if you are truthful, uh, okay, so yeah, why he's saying, your... okay, when I say to you, if you are truthful, tell me the names. Which means if you could not tell me the names, you are not a truthful, correct? Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you very much. Uh -huh, uh -huh. He agreed. So if you are a truthful, tell me the names. But but they could not tell the names. So none of the angels was a truthful. So they are a bunch of liars. No, we did not accuse them of being a bunch of liars. My friend, read carefully. You, you are the one who agreed with me. I say to you. Okay, sir. Can I read? Can I can I read thirty one? Go ahead. Because I don't know what type of tafsir you have, anyways. Read any tafsir you want, no he, problem. And he taught Adam mm. the names, mm. all of them. Then he showed them to the angels and said, "Inform me of the names of these, if you are truthful." Mm. Then it says, "They said, exalted are you. We have no knowledge except what you have taught us. Mm. Indeed, it is you who is the knowing, the wise." Mm. Okay. Mm. It does say if you are truthful, but it does not accuse them of being liars. When I say if you are truthful, obviously I'm accusing you to be a liar. This is what it's if you are truthful. No, 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 no. no. 
it's not like that. My friend, my friend, my friend. Let us read. Let us. You, you are a smart. You said you are studying, going to university, and you are you know educated. Correct. Read carefully with me again. Slow, please. And he taught the names of Adam. So now there is a there is a process to prove something. Allah want to prove something to the angels. What he wanted to prove. Yes. So he taught Adam all the names, and then he placed those things, which mean things have a names, in front of the angels. And then he said to them, if you are truthful, tell me the names, which means if you are unable to tell me the names, you are not truthful. As simple as yes. that. Yes. Exactly. Thank you. He said I yes. Agree. Okay. So I agree, were they I able were, were they Wait, able were they able to tell the names? What does it say 32? What does it say 32, please? Hmm. So what? They said to him, Allah, you are the one who knows everything, no problem. But already they commit sin. They accuse Allah that he will create someone, will do mischievement, and he will do... Because this is the conversation is about. Read the verse before it. He, they said to him, are you okay. going to create someone who will do mischief? Read carefully. Does it say here? The angels, they said, verily. But after he said to them, I'm going to create Adam. They said to him, you will place therein those who will make mischief therein and shed blood. Does it say that? Where? Verse number 30. Okay, yes, 30. Okay, so now the angels, they claim something Allah doesn't agree with. So they are truthful. Does that, does that make it a sin? If I say something and I have no knowledge of questioning God, is that, is that, is that a sin or not? And if it's not sin, why Allah saying to them if you are truthful? Is that a sin? My friend, if I say to you, if you are truthful, that means you are a liar and you say the lie. So here Allah accusing them that they made a lie and this is not a true. And this is why he want to show them that, that you do not verse know. 30, verse, mm. verse 30. Mm. And mention, O Muhammad, when your Lord said to the angels, mm. indeed, I will make upon the earth a successive authority. Mm. They said, will you place upon it one who causes corruption therein and sheds blood? Hmm. Will we declare your praise and sanctify you? Hmm. Allah said, indeed, I know that which you do not know. Okay, so, so he just said them, no, you don't know what I know. Exactly. That's so, it. so okay, no, 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 but, 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 but it's not right. over. No, it it's that. not over here. It's not over. You see, after that, Allah, he ordered the angels to bow down to Adam as a punishment. No, it's not. It's not as a punishment. Here we go. Read. So why are you, Adam is a human? Angels are higher. So, and remember when we say to the angels, bow down in the front of Adam, and all of them they bow down except Iblis. So why they are bowing down to Adam? Because simply they made an accusation against Adam. This is why the story came in order. The order is: Are you going to create someone with doom mischievement and shed the blood? Allah says, I know what you know not. Then he said to them, okay, let me show you. Adam, I will teach you the names. And angels, tell me the names of those things. If you are truthful. So the angels, they were not truthful. And that proved that they are liars. And let, let me ask you, why in the world Allah, he order angels to bow to a human? And to my understanding, mm -hmm. he told them, to bow to his creation, which he has created like nothing before. But he, he created. Told them, but okay. He told, he told but who them. is no? What do you mean he was not created before? So what? So what, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. So now, if I am God, I created a cat. I will ask the angels, who they are higher than the cat, to bow down to the cat. If you want. If I want, but here there is a reason. Yes. Right? Why you are? Why you are escaping the reasoning, making your own fabrication? The angels, they commit sin. Allah accused them to be any truthful. And you agreed with me. He says to them, if you are truthful. So they are not truthful. They are a bunch of liars. And they accuse Adam of mischievement. But let me ask you here. The one, according to the verse, is any truthful is the angels. But the fact is Allah untruthful because Adam needed mischievement. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. Okay, hold on. When the angels, they said Adam would do mischievement. Did he do mischievement or not? Mischievement? Mischievement. Ad Adam, Adam and his children, they will do mischievement. Did they do? Okay, so, so the angels, they were right. And the one is wrong is your God. Okay, let's read from zero, from verse 30. Okay. <laughs> okay. 
so you can understand because you don't understand brother oh yeah okay sure sure okay and mention O oh Muhammad when your Lord said to the angels indeed I will make upon the earth a successive authority they said they said will you place upon it will you place upon it hmm. one who causes corruption therein hmm. and sheds blood hmm. will we declare your praise and sanctify you that's a question it's not a qu it's not uh, it's not a uh, an attack it's a question okay hold on said, hold on hold on no 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 you said that, okay okay it's a question okay hold on no 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 wait one 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 by one don't jump don't jump it's a question for what a question of decision they are questioning how correct and accurate and right decision Allah is making are you going to create someone who will do harm mischievement bloodshed so they are questioning the thinking the stupidity of Allah they are saying to him are you stupid or what are you stu are you stupid are you going to create someone are you going to create someone who will do mischievement he will shed the blood and he is going to be bad are you stupid or what Allah he said I know what you know not which means you are wrong and this is why he said to them if you are truthful but later we find that Jibreel sorry Adam was kicked out from heaven so the angels are right and Allah is stupid okay can we read read go ahead <laughs> okay no no need to be angry brother I'm not angry I'm not okay. angry my friend this is how I talk you know go watch all my videos I have thousands of videos I this is how I talk yeah we are we're Arabs that's how we talk <laughs> yeah so okay continuing yeah so Allah says if, indeed I know that which you do not know mm. verse 31 and then and, and he taught Adam the names all of them then he showed them to the angels and said inform me of the names of these if you are truthful mm. They said, Exalted are you. We have no knowledge except which you have taught us. Hmm. Indeed, it is you who is the knowing the wise. Okay, hold on. Verse uh, uh, Hamudi, Hamudi, I want you to stop. In verse number 32, yes. the angels they say to Allah, We have no knowledge except what you taught us, correct? Yes. Okay, so where they get this from if it's not a lie that he would do harm? They just said to him, We have no knowledge except what you taught us. So how in the world they say something he did not teach them? Did Allah teach them that he would do mischievement and harm and shed the blood? No. That's why he is rejecting what they are saying. Well, he is saying to them, if you are truthful, he is saying to them, I know what you know not. And then he says, tell me the names of those things if you are truthful, which means if you have a knowledge of the unseen, how you know he will do that in the future? How you know I did not even create him yet? And how you know that he will do mischievement? So this is why he is using the word if you are truthful. And now, right now, if I say to you, Hamudi, if you are truthful, give me the reference, give me the evidence. That's mean I make using you of lying. If you are truthful, okay, you come to me. Let us say you are my cousin. You're, you say to me, see, I, okay, Ma, Ma, uh, Hamudi. Let, let us make it simple. Let us make it simple. Let us let us make words. let us make it simple. Let us make it simple. Let us say you, we, me, and you will went to the restaurant, and then I, I, I left, I left, and there's a bunch of guys there, and you were sitting, and you call me. You say, by the way, I'm the one who paid the bill. I say to you, give me the receipt if you are truthful. What does that mean? It's me. If you pay the bill and you don't have a receipt, you are lying. It's not you who paid. But if you are truthful, you give me the receipt. Here, they did not have the receipt. They did not have the knowledge. Allah did not teach them that knowledge. And Allah don't agree with them. And he is saying to them, if you are truthful, will you prove it You're to me? Is they putting this in another situation. No, I'm not. Because here, because here Allah, he said, okay, I will teach Adam all the names. And then he plays the, the things in the front of them. He says, if you are truthful. Is what this means, truthful. It's, here's what it really means. What it really means. Mm. And I'm going to be honest with you. Mm. With you okay? We're okay. honest here. All right. It says, will you place, oh, it was, okay, verse 31. And they said, inform me of the names of these, if you are, are truthful. Mm. And he taught Adam the names, all of them. Then mm. he showed them to the angels and said, mm. so, listen, here God is telling the angels. Mm. It's not the angels telling. Then he showed them to the angels and said, God is telling.
telling the angels, mm -hmm. inform me of the of the names of these, if you are truth. Mm -hmm. It's God who is saying this. Yeah, we know that. I mean, uh, you just found out. This is what and we are saying. <laughs> so, so Allah is saying to them, <laughs> if you, I, 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 I am repeating this for the last two hours, and now you are saying to me, it's Allah saying that. For sure Allah is saying that. What's wrong with you? So Allah is saying to them, if you are truthful, that means he's accusing them of lying because they are not truthful. No, they only have no. Okay, let me ask you, are they truthful in this statement or they are not? He, he only questioned them. This is no. Either you say yes, they were truthful, because he is saying to them, if you are truthful, which means if is a condition, truthful need to be proven. So if you are truthful, you tell me the names. Were they able to tell the names? No. So they are not truthful. And here, by the way, you will see that the one who wrote the Quran, excuse me, is a stupid. Why? Because imagine you see me walking with my dog. And you ask me, I ask you, what is the name of my dog? You say, I don't know. I say the name of my dog is a Juju. And then you say to me, praise be to Allah. You must be God because you are, you know the name. But I am the one who gave him the name. Look how stupid the story. Okay. Uh, Allah, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me explain let's to you. See, before, before, you before you talk, before you talk, before you open your mouth, please listen carefully. How in the world I am going to examine if they knew the, the future by me naming things names what about we do the opposite what about we ask the angels okay you see those things give them names don't tell me what the names you see those rocks those rocks each rock give it a name and then ask me the name of every rock you gave it to, to it and i will tell you that will prove that allah knew the unseen but i give the names i am the one who named the names and then that is a proof that i know the unseen that's the most stupid story ever <laughs> It's like me. Okay. It's like me. It's a, uh, 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 it's a story like there's stories in the Bible. Okay, mm. there's many stories in the Bible. Don't change the topic. Don't change the topic. You are trying to escape the hilarious, stupid, stupidity here. If you have a son, his name is Muhammad, and you see me, and you say to me, a Christian prince, if you are truthful, okay. tell me the name of my son. I say to you, oh glory to Allah. I don't know. You say to me, the name of my son is Muhammad. Is that a proof that you are okay. God? <laughs> it's like me saying, oh, Christian prince, okay, you're, okay, Christian, what's your name, if I can ask? Christian, Christian. Okay, Christian. Mm. Oh, Christian, my son is named Musa. Mm. Do you know what his name, and tell me the truth. You say, you, I only know what you have told me and what you have told me. Only that. I do not know that his name is other than Musa. No, my okay, friend. So my, my, no, no, no. He, he, he did not tell them the names. They did not. He did not and tell them. Hamudi, Hamudi, Hamudi. Stop fooling yourself. Stop fooling yourself. He did not tell them the names. Go open your Elmizan Tafsir and laugh. He did not tell them the names. He is asking them. He made a quiz examination. Tell me the names if you are truthful. They failed. They said we do not know. Listen. And he taught Adam all the names. Exactly. And okay. He showed them to the angels. Mm. We show the things, the things, the things of which we named them. He named things, named things. The word names here is about naming things like a, a banana, orange, a cucumber. Okay. So now he put the things in the front of them. Okay. He said, "Okay." What is your point? My what point, is your point. My point is the whole story is stupid. Angels are sinners and they are liars, lying to Allah, accusing Adam, and then we find out that the angels are truthful. Allah is the stupid because the angels' a prediction was true because Adam, he was kicked out from heaven. I am, I Listen, am close to this let, and let, I cannot convert you into what I believe about this specific matter. No, no, no. About okay, you know what? Uh, you, you know, you know, uh, 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 Hamoudi. I'm going to change topic for you. I will give you an option to prove me wrong. Can you show me one thing in the whole book makes sense? In your book, Quran, choose anything. Like Muslims, they say there's science, there's blah, blah, blah in the Quran. Can you show me something in this book is not stupid? It's a challenge it's from you. Stupid. It's, it's a challenge from you to you. You choose anywhere in the Quran. Look at this challenge, how, how powerful it is. You choose anything from this Quran. And you choose the best, the most strong. Okay. And my duty to prove to you that it is a stupid. 
Okay, I'll do that. Okay, go ahead. Surah Al-Kafirun, Al chapter 109. Are you sure? Yes. Okay. You can go there. All right. Okay. It's a go short ahead. one. Okay, go ahead. It's a short one. No problem. Read it for it's us. It says, Say, O oh, disbelievers, Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim, mm. قُلْ يَا أَيُّهَا الْكَافِرُونَ Say, O oh, disbelievers, mm -hmm. لَا أَعْبِدُونَ مَا تَعْبِدُونَ I mm -hmm. do not worship what you worship, mm -hmm. وَلَا أَنْتُمْ أَعْبِدُونَ مَا أَعْبُدُ mm -hmm. Nor are you worshippers of what I worship, mm -hmm. وَلَا أَنَا أَعْبِدُونَ مَا أَعْبِدُونَ mm -hmm. Nor will you, I be worshipper of what you worship, okay. وَلَا أَنْتُمْ أَعْبِدُونَ مَا أَعْبُدُ Nor will you be worshippers of what I worship, لَكُمْ دِين وَلِيَتِ دِين mm -hmm. For you is your religion, and for me is my religion. Okay. For me, this is common sense, logic, and it's. I think this is a great example I want to present to you. All right. Let me now give you my uh, my opinion that this is one of the most stupid chapters in the Quran, and sadly, it's your choice. So you brought your you brought this to yourself. Look what you just said. Allah said to Muhammad, "Say to the kuffar, I worship not what you worship, but both of them they worship Allah, because the kuffar of Quraysh." They worship Allah too. Number two, and you will not worship what. Hold on, no, hold on, and you do not worship what I worship. Hold on, hold on. Let me answer, please. I, I, I asked you. You gave me the verses. Let me finish, and then nor you worship what I worship, but the kuffar of Quraysh they worship Allah too. And then, and I shall not. Hold on, hold on, and I shall not worship what you worship. But all of us we knew the satanic verses. Muhammad he worshipped the three daughters of Allah. And this is agreed upon by Shia and Sunni. He said that the three daughters of Allah, their intercession is a must. So he worship what they worship. And let us continue. And he said to them, nor you will worship. Hold on, hold on. Look at, look at this disaster. Nor you will worship that which I worship. But later, all of them, they converted to Islam. Yeah, they converted. <laughs> okay, but he said to them, but he said to them, no, you will worship what I worship. This is a prophecy. He said to them, if I say to you, you will never believe in what I believe, and I am prophet, and this is Allah saying that to me, and then later next week you became a Christian, that means my God is a liar, and I am false prophet. I just said to you, you will never believe in what I believe, but next week you became... Your translation is different from mine. My friend, I don't know my, friend my friend, my uh, friend, uh, this is, sense, you, you, for, is you, for, you, you forgot, you, you are the one who did read it. This is the same as you did read it a second ago. You were the one reading it. It's the same. Read, okay, read, read it for us. Read, read verse number five for us in your translation. Okay, brother. Hmm. It says hmm. in Sahih International, uh -huh. Sahih International, hmm. nor you, hmm. and it says, nor will you, in hmm. mine it says, be. In your it doesn't it doesn't say be mm. therefore yours makes it a prophecy nor mm. says mine says nor will you be mm. worshippers of mm. what I worship yours says nor will ye worship mm. that which I worship mm. that is wrong okay. in Sahih International if you go to Sahih International it says nor will you be okay so this is about the future thank you <laughs> nor you will be nor you will be worshiping what I worship this is about the future so worship those okay so those people in tomorrow they worship what he worships so he just gave a false prophecy a prophecy and Muhammad got busted he's a liar because he prophesied that they will not worship what he worship and he will never How worship what they worship but but exactly that. but later both of them they worship the same thing and they became Muslims so you just gave me a stupid verse in the Quran of your choice proving Muhammad to be a fraud and let me now show you how stupid this chapter 2 additional to this uh, you speak Arabic I speak Arabic let us see together so hold on hold on people will die laughing at this I mean what kind of God he say this repeating the same thing because it's the same thing I will take the word worship and I will exchange it with the word eat forget about the word worship I will just add the word eat okay so let us say Allah he said I I eat what you not eat, and you will not eat what I eat, and you shall not eat what I eat, for I eat what you don't eat, and you will not eat what I eat, for you have your food, I have mine. How in the world this is can be from God? You change, you change words. Yeah, so but just to show you how stupid it is, because it's the same. I will not eat what you eat, and you will not eat what I eat, and I will never eat what you eat, because you will not eat what I eat, and I will never do eat what you eat, for you have food. You have your food, I have mine. This is wisdom of God. 
and this is a miracle of God. This is a guy making hummus. This is hummus. This is not God talking. So look what happened. False prophecy, stupid verses, claiming that they will never believe what he believed, and later they converted all of them with no exception to Islam. So okay. how that can okay. be from God? Okay, so you see, you see, let me talk. When you, you and I, you're a Christian right now, right? And I am a Muslim. Do you want to be a Muslim? Why, so I can kiss black stones? No, no, no. Just answer yes or no. Do you want to be Muslim? I'm not stupid, my friend. No. Okay, so you said no. Now, how can I convert you? You see, God is not talking about those who are on the 50-50 side. God is talking about those who are like you, who are... No. Who are... No. He was speaking... No. Okay, let me get you busted again. It says all disbelievers, all of them. He did not say some of the disbelievers. All disbelievers. Say... God, and he was speaking to who? Please. To the people of Quraysh. Thank he was he was in Quraysh. He was in Mecca. All this believer, but later all the people of Mecca became Muslims. He was speaking specifically no. to those people. Not all of them. He said disbelievers. Brother. <laughs> oh disbelievers. My friend, does, does that mean all disbelievers? All disbelievers. Who is the disbelievers? Whoever at that time is a disbeliever. As simple as that. See, if God said, oh, disbeliever, then you would say, who? Who is God talking My about? My friend, and it's would, not about a person. This is all of them. So this is why. Way, this is yeah, why. We'll still find exactly. Somebody. He did not say, oh, disbeliever. He said, oh, disbelievers. So all yeah. of them. And that's why he says in Arabic, ta'budun. This is for a group, correct? You speak Arabic, ta'budun, not for one person. Wala antum. Wala antum, you, they, they, they are a group. Abidun, group, not one person. Wala ana abid, because he is the individual. So he is the individual, they are the group. Who is the group? A disbelievers. And he is prophesying that they will never believe in him and they will not worship what he worship. But he worship what they worship and they worship what he worship. And later all of them became Muslims. And this verse is Shish Kebab Hamas. I will give you I will give you a second chance. The first one the first one did not work. The, the first one did not Hamudi, the first one the first one did not work. No, don't understand me. Don't worry about don't worry about me. I will give you a second chance. This one was Shish kebab. Give me a different one. Give you what? Different one. This one is not good, you know. It's, as you see, it doesn't work. Give me something more more powerful. More powerful. <laughs> mm. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I'll take short ones. So no, take no. It doesn't matter. To... Choose whatever you want. I mean, this is the, for me. You see, this is your opportunity. We have hundreds of Christians listening, and this is your opportunity to show us. What about you? Tell us about the science and the Quran. I heard the Quran have science. The is Quran it, has what? Has science. The Quran teaches science. Is that cor is that correct or it's a lie? It, it teaches science. Yes, it does. Like where? Can you show me something you believe it's really scientifically correct in the Quran? Yes, I can. Go to chapter 21. Chapter 21. Chapter 21. Okay, one. But don't be ignorant. Please I don't be ignorant. I, 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 did not, okay. I did not hear what you said. Chapter 21 what? Verse 30. Verse number 30. Wonderful. Okay, what about it? Go ahead. Don't be ignorant with me, please, okay? Be honest, like I'm honest with you. Okay, okay? go ahead, go ahead. Good, mm. okay. Have those who disbelieved not considered that the heavens and the earth mm. were a joint entity, mm. and we separated them and made from water every living thing, then will they not believe? Mm. 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 Okay. So what is your understanding, understanding of that just? Stupid belief, the Quran teaching that the earth and the heaven, they used to be attached together and Allah separated them. And he used in Arabic the okay. word Do you know what Fataqa means? When like, God like, is talking we, about like, heaven and the earth, okay. he's talking about the universe. Exactly. Is, exactly, the, yes. is, the, is the earth now is separated from the universe or we are inside the universe? Did you did you understand what I say? I, when I, God is talking about the earth and the universe, mm. he's talking about the whole universe as a complete. No, not no, just no, no, no. Read carefully, just, read carefully. And you can open your tafsir so you can die laughing with me. Your Shia tafsir, you will die with it. You will see it says 
that the heaven and the earth, which means there was heaven and there was earth. Have those disputes that the heavens and the earth mm. were a joint entity? That the heavens and the yes, it does say so. Okay, so now we have heaven and we have earth, but this is stupid because how you separate the heaven and the earth when we are inside the heaven, we are just little tiny dust inside the heaven. Are we inside universe? Yes, we are. We are just a dust inside the universe. What wherever we are, we are in the ba balcony it's, of somewhere it's, else. It's Earth inside universe. Yes. Are you saying that the Earth, that the, the universe inside the Earth? No. So where we are, are we are are we inside the universe or outside the universe? Yes, we are. Yes. So how we separate it? This is stupid. And then, no, you're not and then, no, and then he said, listen what, listen and, and then he said, listen, 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 listen to me. okay, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. <laughs> Have those who disbelieve not considered that the heavens and the earth mm. were a joint entity? What does the Big Bang say, please? The Big, Bang, the says, Big Bang says, the Big Bang says there was no heaven, there was no earth, an explosion happened, and that's it. Here it says there is heaven the, and there is earth. Contradicting yourself. Okay, hold on, hold on. Okay, okay, okay. You see, uh, uh, Hamoudi, you just you just uh, brought yourself a disaster. Let me ask you, what is the first thing Allah created? Uh, the first thing Allah created was the the soul of Prophet Muhammad, if I'm not mistaken. Here we go. The soul he was in, um, and and the light of uh, Muhammad from light. But this is not. I'm talking about the the earth and the heaven. Forget about Muhammad the creator from light now. So the earth and the heaven. Which one is it created first? The the universe. The universe, and what is second? What do you, what when you say in the universe? What does that mean? Is that the sky? Time. Uh, huh? What I, what I mean when I say the the universe? What what can I say? No, it's the universe no, that God no, created no, first. No, 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 and then I, no. I, I want no, no, no. There is not there is nothing in Islam is called that Allah created the universe first. This is not true. There is no reference. Chapter 2, verse number 22, it says the following. Who has appointed yes. the earth a resting place for you and the sky as a canopy? All right. So Allah, he made this. This is confirmed according to the Quran that Allah is the one who created both. Correct. In chapter yes. 2, verse number 29, it says, It is he who created for you all that in earth. Then he turned into heaven and he fashioned it as seven heavens. Do you agree with this verse? I didn't hear you good. Can you repeat? Chapter 2, verse number 29 says that Allah created the earth and then he went to heaven and he made them seven heavens. Do you agree with it? No, I don't agree. But this is Quran. Uh, what, what chapter, what verse? Chapter 2, verse number 29. And you don't agree. That's wonderful. You just left Islam. Verse 29. Hmm. It is he who created for you all of that which is on the earth. Hmm. Then he directed himself to the heaven. Hmm. He's being above all creation and made them seven heavens and he is knowing of all things. Thank you. So which one Allah he created first? Which one Allah he created first? It says, it is he who created for you all of that on which earth, is in heaven on earth. earth no no on earth are you understanding okay. that which is in on the earth which okay. is on the earth all right and then on the earth. no problem then, I, I got it i got it but then after that what he did the earth was created and finished before the sky is what the verse is saying do you agree or not because in arabic it That's says your no no you speak arabic i speak arabic both of us it says thumma and thumma is a word for after and uh, after long period so, thumma stawa ila sama, and here this is your translation saying, and then he turned into heaven and he fashioned it seven heaven. So the earth was finished first. Yes. Okay, but you are the one who yeah. quote for me other verse saying that the earth and the heaven they used to be one piece and we separated them, and suddenly you start, start saying this is the big bang. <laughs> Do the big bang believe that the earth created first and then the heaven oh, created second? Okay, okay. Hmm. Do you know Big Bang Theory, first of all? No, I, no I, the, the, only, the, only, the only Big Bang, the only big bang <laughs> I know is uh, 
is my friend he, he have a mother-in-law she give him a big bank every 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 weekend this is the only big bank i know but here we have a law saying my friend does it say in the front of us don't waste my time does it say allah created the earth and then he went to the sky and then he finished them seven seven skies yes or no yes okay so the earth is finished first do you agree with that no what do you mean no interpretation not my interpretation my friend it's in front okay hold on let us go to al-mizan isn't it you who said al-mizan what 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 the mizan say okay let's go to al-mizan no problem go to al-mizan al-mizan uh -huh. <coughs> what's the verse verse 29 20 correct yeah okay uh let's find it okay okay i need to open i just need to uh, find it if that's fine sure go ahead general comment commentary or on okay mm. uh, okay but as you can see he has made a general comment and a commentary and then the quran yeah because you are you, are, you choose a potato interpretation this is a potato this is a guy he he, he give interpretation no, for nothing the, this guy I'm trying to say, this guy if I go this, on this, no no this is what general say, what general does it say then he turned into the sky does it say then which means there is one is first and then there is after yes or no okay should we read read okay general comment the talk reverts again to the initial topic mm. the beginning of the chapter dealt with three categories of mankind mm. then all were addressed together verses 21 to 27 with the words o men now these verses describe the same subject with a great with a greater detail the 12 verses starting from here depict depict the reality of man mm. show the potential potentialities of perfection which allah has endowed him with Hamoudi, 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 with, with my respect to you, this is garbage. Where is my answer? Give me the answer from based on this interpretation, which is stupid. What is the answer? Then I read say this is a trash. There's this no answer. Garbage. You see, this guy is not, uh, this guy is a, is, a, is a fraud. Where is the answer? Where is the interpretation for the verse? He's just making, making fuss. He's making noise. He keep talking too much until now. He did not even explain the verse. Where is the explanation for the verse there? We don't see it. I'm reading and it's go and it's leading up, but you don't. You're no, not it's patient. not there. I have the book in the front of me. This guy is reading everything except the verse. We need understanding for it. Where is the verse? It says I open it. I have the book of the Sirul Mizan in front of me. Where, where, where it says? Where is the explanation? Where is the explanation? Where is the explanation? No explanation. I told you I do not know. That's why I told you to. If Thank you very speak. much. So why you chose this book where there's no exp I mean, each time we open this book, we find no explanation for the verse. Obviously, there's something fraud there. So what about you choose a different book? Do you want to choose? Okay, I can choose a different book. If okay, choose fine. one. Which one you want? It's not really a book. It's a site. <sighs> <laughs> no, we want a scholar. No, we don't want. We don't. We don't want shish kebab guy. Already, already the, your scholar is a shish, shish kebab already. So you bring me more shish kebab. That's enough. We want something we can we can accept. Okay, okay, you know? okay. I'll just okay. Listen, I'll talk about this verse, the tafsir. I'll read it. Then we'll talk about the Bible, if you're willing. My friend, don't change the topic. You are trying to escape from the disaster. How in the world okay. this is? How in the world this has happened? Your God cannot be God. You see, you are the one who speak about science. You are the one who choose it. And now when we, we try to examine it, we find that this book is a stupid, literally stupid. How we can accept such a book? How you in 2020, you accept such a book? How can you accept the Bible? 
Sure, I accept the Bible, and here we go. You change the topic of each time you are in the corner, you go, you change the. And secondly, the second, the most time they speak about the Bible, this the same second they prove Islam to be false because isn't it the Quran says Allah He sent the Injil, and then Allah He could not protect the Injil. That's mean Allah is a shish kebab too because if I send the book and I am God, I will never let anyone to play with my book. So how you Muslims, no, okay. how you Muslims have the courage so, so to accuse, the Bible hasn't been listen, 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 how you Muslims accuse your God to be stupid to the point he is weak, he cannot protect his book because you, what when you say to me, do you believe in this book? You are saying to me, do you believe in the book of Allah? So you are saying to me, the book of Allah is corrupted. Thank you. Correct? No, I'm not saying that. That's what you're saying. No, you are saying to me, do you believe in the book? It's mean you don't believe it. Do you believe in it, you? Do you believe in it? In what? Do you believe in the Bible yourself? Uh, not really, no. Because okay, so that so a change. Thank you very much. Here we go. You see, you just say the change. So you just say the book of Allah changed. And this is additional proof that Allah cannot be God. Because if this is his book, he is the one responsible to protect it, not me. Okay, so I am a Bible. Listen, 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 listen. God should not trust a human being to protect his book. Is that correct? Because a human being, no. a human being is a liar, a human being is corrupt, a human being he commits sin. Isn't it you Quran teach that all a human beings are sinners? So how you trust a human being to protect your book? So this is the duty of God, for he is eternal. We die, he don't die. We lie, he don't lie. We we commit sin, he don't commit sin. He is the one who can protect it and nobody else. So you are saying to me that your God, he sent books, but he cannot protect his books. That's mean he is the same as me. Actually, me, I'm you, more powerful than Allah. I have my... Do you I, believe the Old Testament has been changed and such? Because God clearly delivered it to... My friend, Moses, my friend, right? in, in order to, to right? say, in order to say, in order to, in order to say, in order to say, okay, let me show you how... Uh, uh, Hamuri, let me show you how stupid what you just said. I'm not calling you stupid, by the way, but you are just copying what people say, you know, without knowledge. Let me show you. Does the Quran approve the Old Testament and the New Testament, yes or no? The Old Testament and the, it approves the Injil. No. Doesn't matter. The Quran, does it approve what we have with us, Christian and Jews, yes or no? If it approves, yeah. Okay, but first, do you think that the Injil and the Bible is the same thing? My friend, doesn't matter now. Listen carefully. Listen carefully. I want you to be smart. No, no, no. Does the matter. Quran? Let's, yes. Doesn't matter. Let us say I have with me a book. It's called Yellow Pages. Okay. Does the Quran says that I agree with what they have in their position? Yes or no? Okay. okay. I do not agree with the Bible. You know what? This is not. This is not a question. Does the Quran agree that the Quran saying that he agree with the books we have doesn't matter what the name does it say that in the Quran? No. Okay, read for me. Okay, no, no, chapter two. No, 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 no. Chapter two, Listen verse. To chapter two, verse number eighty-nine. Chapter two, verse number eighty-nine. It says, and when there comes to them a scripture from Allah confirming that in their position, does it say that? I can show you a verse. Don't show me now. Don't change the topic. Thing. Don't change it. Don't change the topic. No, no. Allah confirm. Change. Confirm what? Confirm in what we possess. What we possess. What did you say? Quran says Allah agree with the books the Christian and the Jews have, which we possess. Okay. What we have. It says. It says in Quran. Hmm. Surah Baqarah, hmm. verse ninety-seven. Say anyone who opposes Gabriel should know that he has brought down this Quran into your heart in accordance with God's will confirming mm. previous scriptures and providing mm. guidance and good news for the believers. Mm. Okay. 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 Quran, first of all, 97. first of all, first of all, I want you to show me the word previous. And if you can show it to me, I will show, I will shave my 20 foot beard where it says the previous scriptures. In Quran 97? Hmm. 
does it say does it say confirming you are the one who says to me you are reading 97 or 91 97 97 okay but look at 91 he will have a problem and it is the truth agreeing confirming what they have with their hand right now so the bible is confirmed in the quran agreeing with it chapter 2 verse number 91 now we go to 97 so we can die laughing at the quran read carefully this is your, this is your choice and then the one who is the enemy of Jibreel. Who is the word the enemy of Jibreel? Can you give me his name? Wait, let's read. Let me read. No, 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 no. Before, no. What do you mean, Jibreel? Right? You are the one who did, you did read already. Can you give me the one who is the enemy of Jibreel? Who is that? Who is that? <laughs> you tell me. <laughs> And then, and then he continues saying, and then he continues saying, confirming what they have with them, not before. Read carefully how they lie in the translation. Here it says, confirming that which was revealed before it. But it doesn't say that in Arabic. You speak Arabic as I do. It says, yeah, because false translation. No, it says, exactly, says, exactly, false translation. False. Thank you. Thank you, false translation. Okay. Uh, does it say does it say musaddiqan does it say musaddiqan lima bayna yadayhi i will translate either you agree or you say it's a lie confirming what is between his hands yes or no read read loud for me confirming what is between his okay. hands hmm In Arabic. In Arabic, lima bayna yadayhi. Translate for us. Musaddiqan lima bayna yadayhi. Translate. It means between his hands. Confirming what, agreeing, correct? Agreeing, believing in what is between his hands. So the Bible is between our hands and it's true. Because it's confirming it. <laughs> also in our hands and it's true. no it says what is between our hand and this is the same repeated again in verse verse after verse you know here we go verse number 101 I and mean, you look how many times the same thing and when there come into them messenger from allah confirming that what they possess okay <laughs> listen i understand your point of view Hamoudi, Hamoudi, Hamoudi. Here's what you have. Let me, let me, let me tell you something. I'm not against you. And it's, it's not brother. about, it's not about against me, against you. I do not know you. You do not know me. I don't hate you. You don't. I hope you don't hate me, my friend. Here, we are trying you. to seek the truth. And as you see, your God, Allah, cannot even remember which one He created first. And you must then copy paste. You come to us. You see the Bible corrupted. When the Quran says the Bible never been corrupted. Because there's one listen, verse. Listen, listen okay, there's, there's, let me talk. You never allow me to talk. Please. No, that's not true. If we go back to zero, I will go back to zero. Okay, let, me, let me ask let you me again. You, you see why you are listen, why you are escaping topic please, after topic. This please, a, please, a, a disaster. Please. No, I want to know. I want to know. Yes. Did Allah created yes. the earth first or the yes. sky? Yes. I, I want to yes. know. Yes. You see. The Quran yes. says, the Quran says, the Quran says, if this book is not from Allah, you will find in it a lot of contradiction, correct? Brother, just listen to me, okay? My friend, I lost my voice talking to you for the last two hours and you are telling to me, listen to me. I'm asking you, does it, is it true? The Quran says, if this is book not from Allah, you will find a lot of contradiction in it? Does we find a lot of contradiction in it? Hmm? Does it say the Quran? Does the Quran says? How come they cannot deal with the Quran? The Quran admit that the Quran is stupid to the point people Quran. How come they cannot figure out this book? If this book is not from Allah, you will find a lot of the contradiction. Simple question will make it simple for us. Okay. Which one Allah you know? created first? Which one Allah created first? The Can earth, my friend. Okay, please from you. I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? You are the Muslim, not me. 
Does that mean I have to know everything? Okay, but I, I gave you a verse from the Quran, my friend. What's wrong with you? Isn't it me who gave you a verse from the Quran saying that it is he what who creates? Hold on. I mean, what's okay. wrong with you? Hamoudi, listen. Chapter 2, verse number 29 says, It is he who created for you all that in earth. And then, then, which means after, he went to the sky and he created, he, he, he made them seven heaven. So which one of them he created first? It does not say number one i created earth it number says two, no it says he, no, three, no 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 let us make let us make it simple let us make it simple he finished first he finished which one first the earth or the heaven okay it is and i will be honest with you my mm. brother okay, okay. Mm. it is he who created for you mm. all of that mm. which is on the earth mm. then he directed himself to then he directed himself to the heaven mm -hmm. okay mm -hmm. now what is heaven i don't i don't care uh, heaven maybe is a kini I, I mean come on suddenly now you are going to question what is heaven heaven is the sky it doesn't say even you see it doesn't say even the word heaven in, in, in arabic in arabic it doesn't say even the, the word heaven it says it says it says skies it says it says skies correct doesn't say heaven it says skies no, no, it says. What do you mean, says, no? Then he turned the what? heaven. It says heaven. No, it no, it says the skies. Read with me. Sab or Samawat. You speak Arabic. What's wrong with you? As -sama yes, Samawat. Samawat is a sky. Okay, so it's a sky, not heaven. Now, so he created everything in earth, finished. Then he went to the heaven and then he made them seven. So which one of them is done first? that which is on the earth thank you very much finally hamoudi he gave me the answer finally so everything in the earth is finished and then he starts yes, walking in the sky is that correct you still have it understood huh you see you still have it understood you still have it understood you get... okay what's samai there's no samai in the whole verse my friend what's samai in verse 29 yeah so al -Baqarah, yeah this okay as some, as some, because it was one in the beginning and then he made them seven so but which one he finished first all creation is earth it says it is he who created for you that all in the earth does it say all it which is on on the earth thank you okay then he went to the sky and he made them seven so which one created all first the one in the earth or the one in the sky okay so you you giving me a good uh, a good question here okay now if you go to another verses in the quran my if friend, you my friend my friend before you go why you to give me an answer what why you to give me an answer it's very simple <laughs> It's very it simple. It says he created everything on earth. Then, when you say then, that's mean then happen after. Uh, it, I don't. What do you mean? Uh, what do you mean? I you don't. Understand you good here. What can do you, you, can what, you repeat? Okay. When I say I made my key, my tea, then I went to the bedroom. So which one I did first? You get. <laughs> You, you gave me my tea, then you went to the bedroom. Okay, which one happened first? You obviously gave me your tea. Thank you. So here, he finished everything on earth, then he went to the sky and he made them seven. So the sky became seven after he finished everything on earth. Do you agree? Uh, then he... Then he turned to the to a sama. Yes. Hmm. So you agree now that the earth, everything in earth, finished first, correct? On earth. Correct. But that, does that mean that he created earth first? Yes, for sure. But here about who? What, uh, you see, I'm not asking you which one he created first. Now I was saying which one Allah finished first. So Allah finished everything in the earth first, correct? Okay. Okay. So finally. We... Finally, we have an, an example. Finally, we have an agreement. Me and Hamoudi, 
that Allah, he finished the earth first. Do we agree on that? Mm, yes. Okay. And the heaven after, do we agree on that? Yes, sama. Yeah. The sky. Yes, yeah, sama. Okay. Sky. Yeah. Heaven. Okay, so the earth first, the sky after, be my witness. But if we go in the Quran, we will find the opposite. In different verse, Allah, he says the following. Have you ever heard of a God? He do not know which one he finished first. Read carefully. In chapter 79, verse number 27, it says, Are you harder to create or the heaven that he built? He raised height, therefore, and ordered it. And he made dark and night, therefore, and he brought forth the morn, therefore. And after that, what is after that now? The opposite. After that, he made the earth flat. After that, he made the water. After that, he made the mountains. After that, he made the animals. But in the other verse, you agreed that Allah finished everything in earth and after that, he started working in the sky. He made the sky seven. He put the stars, etc. But here, it is totally 180 degree opposite direction. Allah, he created the sky. He lift up the sky. He made day and night, which means stars. And then after that, he made the earth flat. And then after that, he produced water and grass. And after that, he put mountains and after that he created the animals so which one of them is made by allah uh, all things which is put on earth then the isama hmm. did you hear me i hear you i'm laughing so where is the answer how in the first verse chapter 2 Allah and you agreed everybody heard you it's recorded you said and you agreed that yes the earth is finished first and then he start working in the sky that's wonderful this one saying the opposite when Allah he finished the sky the earth was not done so he made the earth flat because it says and after that he spread the earth and after, which means after that, anything after this line is after, that's it. So what he did after he finished the sky, and he made the stars, and he made day and night, after that he made the earth flat, after that he made the water, after that he made mountains, after that he made the grass, the trees, and, uh, and the animals, and then this is total contradiction. Okay, so you're going 41, 9, 12. You want 41, 9, 12? Wonderful, here we go. Actually, you see, Hamoudi is helping me. I was going to speak about it next to show him the madness. Let us go to 41. Okay. Read 41, okay. 9, 12. Okay, and, say, and, okay. He disbelieve in mm. he who created the earth in two days. Thank you. Attribute to him equals. That is the Lord of the worlds. Okay. Uh, and he played, he set mountains over its surface mm. and he blessed it and determined therein its creatures mm. sustenance in four days within distinction mm -hmm. by the information of those who ask mm -hmm. then he directed himself to the heaven while mm -hmm. it was smoke mm -hmm. and said to it and to the earth mm -hmm. come into being willingly or by compulsion mm -hmm. they said we have come willingly mm -hmm. and he completed them as seven heavens within mm -hmm. two days and inspired in each heaven its command Okay. And we adorned the nearest heaven with lamps and as protection. Wonderful, that is Hamoudi. the determination of the exalted in might and knowing. Okay. But if they turn away, then say, I have warned you stop, stop. of a thunderbolt. The rest, the, rest like the, the rest is not needed. Listen, oh, so okay. now based on this, based on this, based in chapter 41, Allah finished what before and finished what after? I want you to be honest. Okay, first. The Quran does not lay a definitive sequence of events. No, it does. It does. Quran. Don't, don't, uh, Hamoudi, don't, don't, don't lie. Don't lie. Read with me carefully. It says, then, then, when you say then, and in Arabic it says, thumma stawa. It means it happened no, after. First, huh? Second, third, fourth. Fifth, no, no, second. it says, it says, no, no, it says then. Doesn't matter, second, first. No, it says, my friend, it says, that then, when you say then, that means whatever happened after this then is after. You have to agree. You cannot, please be honest. 
Does it say then? Yep. Okay. When but we that say. That does not mean it's first. What do you mean? No. You can take it also. No, you reverse. cannot. No, Arabic is so clear. It says thumma stawa. So he, after that, he did this. And actually, the other verse, the Quran, which here it says, well, ardu ba'da dhalika. I mean, how clear we can make it. And after that, does it say after that, or I'm making things up? The Quran did not intend for these verses to be interpreted. My friend, take care. I, I, don't, I, don't, I, don't, I, don't, I don't take to liars. I'm not going to waste my time. You are not being honest now. And the second you start playing games, I have no time to spend with you. Two hours and you insist to be a liar, I have no need for you. As simple as that. 